What is up, guys? YouTube 33 Like, subscribe, and share to links in the description. So we got an important um, safety recall on this car here, which is a Ford Focus. Let me see if I can get some of the, you know, interior here. Uh, but yeah, this is a Ford Focus. Uh, basically, um, we got safety recall, and we're gonna see what they say over there at Ford because they told us just to bring it in. They're gonna fix the gas or there, but this is not about the gas. This is like. A bunch of uh, other stuff let me see it has to do with the engine guys the engine light or the sign or whatever so it says uh, notice in your accordance to the National Traffic and Motor Vehicle Safety Act Ford Motor Company has decided that a defect with which relates to motor vehicle safety exists in your vehicle with the VIN number shown above we apologize for the situation or your vehicle engine due to um, canister purge valve cpv with um the full vapor system so so all these things right here the ser service engine soon light is on which it is and so there's a recall so let's go see what, let's go to ford and see what they say Guys, we are here at Ford, Tipton Ford. We're gonna go show them the paper uh, they sent us, and we're gonna see what they're gonna say. Cause uh, you know they need to fix this cars that they messed up for free. Well, the labor is because it's a lot of work. So he said that the recalls are done on the other side of the building, so I, we gotta go around. So I'm gonna try and record you guys nonchalant so they don't see me. One more question. My my truck is one of those that, that they sent me a recall for that thing that was okay. shipped down. All right. Which I'll, is something you would be able yeah, to do Yeah, I'll, I'll check all the recalls on it. It's a 13, right? Yeah, 2013. Okay. Yeah, we just got the, the upgraded software, so we'll we'll take care of it for you. Awesome. Thank you. Okay. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. You gave them the keys, right? The truck Okay. Let me get it for you. So they had ordered them. They just hadn't called you back. It said that they were, when I received this, was, which was in December, they said that they were in the process of ordering, which should be the first quarter of 2019, okay. which was April. So I hadn't received the call as of now. Okay. So had you called in with us? I called once, and um, I, I forget who I talked to, but she mentioned something about it being a recall having to do with the gas or something. Okay. Because the gas can't be, like, below half a tank for this, you know, to not be as dangerous as the recall is. Okay. Yeah. Have you had any issues with it? Um, lately, when I've been hitting the gas, mm -hmm. it doesn't really, like it's, sometimes it won't even work when I, I mean, when I hit the brake okay. when it's going, so that's something kind of serious. Okay, so the one that I see on here, which is a safety recall, is the, the fuel tank deformation. Mm -hmm. So basically what we do is we inspect the tank from the bottom to see if it is uh, warped in any way because they can warp inward. Okay. So uh, basically there's a valve in there, it's called a purge valve, mm -hmm. that for your emissions kind of lets out the gases so it does that doesn't happen. Okay. So that when that valve stops working it could cause the, the tank to kind of deform in a way mm -hmm. and, and kind of go upward. So if that happens, if it's um, a certain amount of, of space, maybe about, I think it's an inch mm -hmm. or more, 
We replace the tank. We also replace the, uh, the purge valve and we replace the canister as well. So we do have to inspect it first. There are cases where nothing needs to be done. The tank is fine, the, the valve is fine, it's just a recall and inspection. So um, those are the two things on there. The other ones that you have are going to be for your transmission. Um, how many miles are out the vehicle? I think it's 156,000. Okay, so I think you're out of both of these warranties. Because the other two are going to be for your transmission. One of them is for the clutches, which um, some people can experience uh, really harsh uh, shifts. Mm -hmm. Like when you're driving, you can kind of just like, mm -hmm. like shift into the next gear really hard. So um, that's one. The other one is for the, okay, go ahead. The other one is for the module, transmission module, which could turn on a check engine light and could also give you um, problems with the transmission too. But I want to say that's till 150, yeah. So the module is still 150,000 miles, so if you're over that, then we wouldn't be able to do that under warranty. The clutches, I want to say, are 120. Let me make sure. How many miles? 156,000. How many did you have back in December? I think, I don't remember. No? It might have been a little bit over. 150. Mm -hmm. I think it's a transmission. Yeah, what you're explaining is probably your transmission. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so this one's actually only to 100,000 miles. Mm. Seven years, 100,000 miles. The, the module is for um, 12 years? No, 10 years, 150. So you're out because of the miles, so we wouldn't be able to perform those recalls or those coverages. What we can perform is going to be the, the tank. Okay. Now, they were on back order. The tanks were on back order, so we didn't have any in stock. We do have some now, and even if we don't have them, they're a lot quicker to get. Um, I know beforehand when people would come in, we would have to order. send them on their way or leave the vehicle here, and we just started receiving them maybe, I think, late April. Okay. So so we do have parts already. Okay. Um, we can inspect if it's needed. We do have to do the inspection. Um, that might not take care of your issue that you're having, because mm -hmm. to me it sounds like it's going to be your transmission. Okay. So more than likely you're probably going to need your clutches, which is in the transmission, mm -hmm. and maybe even the module. And I know um, without warranty the clutches are, you're looking to spend about $2,000 to repair them. Um, and then the module, I'm not sure. I wouldn't be able to quote you on that one because I'm not sure how much it is. But, but we can take care of the recall for you. Let me set you up with an appointment. Has that this vehicle been here before? No. no. Is this name here? Um, now, if it does need replacement, it might be an extra day. Okay. When were you planning on going out of town? You need an extra day with it. Okay, cool. And you said about 156,000 miles? Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, so you heard it here first. Uh, they can't do it because of how many miles are in the car, but if not, you know, we could uh, got a new transmission. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and share. Check out links in the description, boy, and peace out.